whoever you are Are you dancing on the dance floor Drinking by the bar Tonight we do a beat You can shine like stars And we don't give a fuck Cause that's just who we are And we are Totally new episode. Oh, we got exciting for the. Yes, let's enjoy. Come on. <laughs> okay, 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 guys. Okay, guys. So let's back to the, our show. Oh yeah, right. yeah, 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 yeah. Time is limit. The last show we talk about the gatekeeping theory, and we got a huge amount of re reflections yeah. from our audience to ask us to make a new show. Yeah, uh, since our first video published, uh, a lot of fans they sent emails to us. They said, uh, in our show, they get a better understanding to understand what the theory is in a funny way. So, yeah. Cool. So, as you wish, we made another video for the communication theory, and that is selective exposure. Well, as usual, in the first part, uh, we're gonna discuss the definition about theory. This theory is kind of harder yeah. than the last one to explain. Yeah. So this time, we prepare a new method to present the definition. Let's welcome my magician friends, Evan. Hi, this is Evan. Today, I will show you a new world of selective exposure. It's a fantastic world. Are you ready? Here we go! Selective exposure is a theory within the practice of psychology, often used in media and communication research, that historically refers to individuals' tendency to favor information which reinforces their pre-existing views while avoiding contradictory information. 
Selective exposure to information refers to the phenomenon in which individuals tend to prefer information that supports a certain view or decision, and in which they tend to neglect conflicting information. According to the historical use of the term, people tend to select specific aspects of exposed information, which they incorporate into their mindset. These selections are made based on their perspectives, beliefs, attitudes, and decisions. People can mentally dissect the information they are exposed to, and select favorable evidence, while ignoring the unfavorable. The foundation of this theory. Is rooted in the cognitive dissonance theory, which asserts that when individuals are confronted with contrasting ideas, certain mental defense mechanisms are active to produce harmony between new ideas and pre-existing beliefs, which results in cognitive equilibrium, which is defined as a state of balance. Between a person's mental representation of the world and his or her environment, is crucial to understanding selective exposure theory. According to Jean Piaget, when a mismatch occurs, people find it to be inherently dissatisfying. Now we see that the human will be affected by the selective exposure in their mind. Not like our reason, no motion. They're stupid. So we do a short little experiment to examine this. So let's see how the people will be affected. So people ask me why I like Gardier. Well, it's just a taste of luxury. Beautiful. Oh my God! I can't believe I'm getting this. Ah, oh, I can't love you more. It's from Fifth Avenue, my little baby. I love the makeup on that model, and the eyebrow, the things she used. I'm pretty sure it's from Makeup Forever, and I love the eyeshadow. The eyeshadow is from Japan. It's a very famous brand in Japan. It's called Kledipo. Well, so from the experiment,、uh, we know that the human opinion is quite strong, right?、Mm. So I have a question about、mm -hmm. the selective exposure. So,、um, is it inherent, or、uh, it can formed, you know, during、uh, the human growth, or it can be changed by another elements or factors? Well, I think it can be changed. It's a process, actually. It depends on the frequency people get some information or something.、Mm -hmm. Well, and also the strength of the certain man is also can be changed. Yeah, I agree,、mm -hmm. and I think the the opinion, the strength of the opinion is can be stronger and stronger in set、uh, in certain circumstance in certain situation. And I think the first one maybe is the selectivity. Uh, will increase following a decision and a commitment one person got to do. Well, I think I got an example. We have fallen down again tonight. 
hard to get it right. Trying to make your heart feel like a glove. What it needs is love, love, love. Everybody, everybody wants to love. Everybody, everybody wants to be loved. Oh. Tend to get some information, what they got interest in, in many ways by themselves. For example, for love. Yeah, um, yeah. Like everyone has that experience like that. Like yeah. for in love with a girl, and uh, uh, like me, I I pretend to <clears throat> get all the informations about her, like Facebook pages. Yeah. I uh, collect. Her photos, something like that. Yeah, and we we all do that, already, you know. Right, right. And so, so the people always uh, to tend to increase the uh, selective exposure according to the decision and commitment uh, they can do. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, but according to the right their own opinion. Well, yeah. So in another, you know, situation, um, the selectivity will also increase you know, following the involuntary exposure, you know, to the unsupportive information. You know, in next video, we're gonna show you how it works. Without a sound. Yeah. Hi, Lily! Hey! Oh my god! I 
to see you for a while. How are you doing? Yeah, I know I've been slumping a lot. But I finished my project now. It's cold outside. Oh, by the way, this is my classmate, Sean. That's June. Hi, Sean. Uh, have I met you somewhere? Yeah, yeah, I think we have not a way to class, I think, here with this. Yeah, you look so familiar. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, so, how I've been doing so we are doing something. I miss you. I know I miss you too much. Let's just say we need a long conversation. Let's just say. Let's say. Oh, okay. Sure. No problem. So, are we gonna watch a movie today, or just yeah, sit down? Yeah, sure. It's a Chinese movie. It's a Chinese movie. Show us what happened before Sean fell in love with June. Yeah, the decision Sean made is not exist at the very first beginning. And uh, the first, she didn't even know her and don't know, didn't know uh, who she is and who, uh, what he likes. But after the uh, involvement. Uh, Nuri uh, exposure of certain information about June yeah, coming from his friends or other resources she's getting better and better understand uh, the girl and uh, decide to fall in love with her yeah so now we know the selective exposure is not inherent right right it's developed you know during the growth of a human right it's step by step form and it also can be influenced or affected by another kind of elements, factors, right? Right, it's a kind of process. Yeah. Well, it also depends on the confidence. The uh, more confidence you have, and the result will be changed more and more. Yeah, so the selectivity is inversely related to the amount of confidence of a person has in his initial position. So next video, uh, we're gonna show you what happens and what uh, Sean will behave uh, when his uh, love being changed. So many interesting things happen these days. Look at this. Whoa, what's that? What? Oh, no, 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 nothing. Come on, just show me, come on. What happened? Oh, you don't want to see that. It's true, and another guy showing you the know, same picture. I mean, come on, it can be her girlfriend, so relax.
tonight I got the TV home The sound turned down And a bottle of wine There's pictures of you and I On the walls around me The way that it was and could have been Surrounds me I'll never get over you Walking away Go of my pain to hell with my pride, let it fall like rain from my eyes. Tonight I wanna cry. It's a sad story. Sean didn't hold his position to the very end, unfortunately, but. It's quite understandable. People always do that. If he didn't have the confidence in his initial position, he would change. Yeah. Well, so through the show, I think all of us can get a basic understanding about what is selective exposure and how it works, or you know, uh, what kind of elements or factors will affect or influence this you know, selectivity. Right. Mm -hmm. Did you guys get the key of the selective exposure? If you do, you are my boy. If you're not, please press the restart and watch again. So don't forget to subscribe us. And uh, if you have another funny opinion or a uh, comment, you can just write comment below or send us an email so you can look forward to our next show yeah. it's gonna be fun now it's time to say goodbye say goodbye yeah, yeah. what? come on <laughs> Let's welcome. Never. 
让我吓人自己。Let's welcome， 你们只是 friends。我操！我都没笑，我都没笑到，我都没笑。